Okay, we're going to do a tutorial for this cute little Santa cupcake. Start with any cupcake. We chose red velvet because it's super festive. And we're going to use a little bit of buttercream and just give it a little bit of a dome top. You can use any kind of buttercream. We're using just an American buttercream. And this will act as the glue for our fondant and also will be very tasty. So after you spread it on, you can um, throw it into the refrigerator or freezer just for a few minutes to get it nice and firm. Okay, so our cupcake is chilled for a little bit. And we're going to take our spatula and just smooth out the buttercream a little bit more. So that'll be a nice base for our Santa face. Okay, so now we're going to take a circle cutter. And you want it to be a little bit bigger than the cupcake itself so that the fondant um, doesn't come up too short. And we've rolled a little bit of flesh-colored fondant out. You want to roll it pretty thin. And we're going to cut a circle out with our cutter. And then place it right onto our cupcake. Move it out using your fingers. Okay, our next step is going to be to make Santa's hat. We're going to roll out some fondant, also very thin, about an eighth of an inch thick. And we're going to use um, a circle cutter again and cut another circle out. And this time we're going to use a pizza cutter and just slice off a little bit. Okay. And we're going to use a little bit of water on a paintbrush and just wet the top of the cupcake where you want to attach the hat to. Okay. And then we're going to use a little clay tool and we're just going to give it a little bit of a definition. This just gives a little whimsy to him. It's time to pipe all his hair and fur. So we're going to use a piping bag full of buttercream. And first we'll start with a little pom-pom. And then we'll do his fluffy fur hat trim. And we're just doing a little swirl motion, but you could really use any kind of piping technique. And there's his beard. And you want to use buttercream so it tastes delicious. So now we finished the beard, and we're just going to pipe on a cute little mustache. So now we're going to create the eyes, and we're going to use a number two tip, and we're going to just punch out where we want his little eyeballs to be. We'll use an 802 tip to create a little divot for the mouth. Okay, and now we're just going to take the clay tool and just sort of Give him a little more of a mouth, a little smile, because he's a jolly guy. <laughs> and then we are going to roll a little nose out of the flesh color. And just drop it right on. Okay. And now to finish up, we're going to take some little dragees we have in black and pink. If you don't have these, you could just use a little bit of fondant also. And we're going to drop them right into the eye sockets. <laughs> little Santa eye sockets. And then we'll take a little pink one, just give him a little bit of a tongue. The jolly old elf. We hope you enjoyed our little tutorial. Merry Christmas.